Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a lovely week so far. <laughs> that sounded a lot less gross in my head. The real question here is why am I imagining what my drink's gonna sound like when I drink it in my head before I drink it? Oh, hello. I never gave, I never gave my alien a name. I made a video with this in it and I never told you guys who won the name choosing process. I don't know why I'm tapping his head like this. I'm looking through the comments now of the video. Someone said Chip, which is a really cute name, but I name all my laptops Chip. So someone said $45 for a cushion, are you on crack? I got my Lotso, which was the same size as this for, for 60 quid. So that's almost double the price. So I'm sorry, that's the, that's life for you, Lucy. <laughs> E.T. is a really good name by Cindy. Cindy, Cindy suggested that E and then like T-E-A. I kind of want to call you E-T, is that all right little guy? Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I got some mail. I've, I've just really missed doing fashion content. So fashion content is bad and as bad as ever. Why is it as bad as ever? You all scream. Well, this is probably the... That was one of the scariest moments of my life and you managed to capture that on camera. I thought that box was just gonna fly onto my coffee and coffee was gonna fly everywhere. That would have been so tragic. Anytime there is water spillage, especially in the bedroom, I go nuts because high moisture, high mold. We have a dehumidifier sitting over there. It's not on at the moment because the window's open, but I get so paranoid about water, especially milky water. Can you imagine the dilemma? Christ. Thank you, universe. You're clearly on my side today. Thanks. This is such a badass box that it's trying to ruin my life already. You'd probably not be wearing shoes that are trying to kill me, right? This is such a badass brand and the products in here are killer and just the shoes I'm about to show you guys. Oh, I did kind of pick, oh, I don't like putting things that have been in the outside on my bed, such as me, but you know, I don't, I don't count. I've noticed that they are a really like, um, kind of alternative brand, that's for sure. However, they also kind of do stuff you can put into your daily wear items too. So they don't just do going out stuff. They also have like the casual wear, like, I mean, it won't be casual for the standard Mary Jane, but cool, but, on an office day like they will try and amp it down a little bit but then they do the extreme like chain platform boots that look wicked with like a really funky outfit and i'm just so excited to show you let's shut up this is a sponsored video. The reason why I love doing fashion sponsored videos the most is because I can tell you when I don't like something because it's like, at the end of the day, it's all about taste, right? Like no one's gonna say to me, I don't wanna sponsor you anymore because you said you didn't like the handbag that you that you got delivered to you. That doesn't mean the, the bag's not cool. Like it's preference, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> and what makes it more exciting is I don't actually know what items they decided to, to choose. I just told them which ones I liked and they did the rest. For all I know, they could have picked every single item, which they might as well have actually done because this box is so big. I would not be surprised if they just said, yeah, let her have them all. La Moda, I'm gonna leave their link down there. I will try, well, I will leave a link to every every actual shoe that you see. I don't get commission on each item. If you buy something, I'm not gonna benefit. If you don't buy something, I'm not gonna benefit. So like, <laughs> so I've just been told by La Moda directly that there is a coupon code exclusively for you lot. <laughs> so you can use LE30 and you get 30% off everything. Anything that you want on the store, put it in your basket and that will give you 30% off. That's pretty good. That's 30%, that's pretty good. Look at their logo, by the way. Love that. It's very like female positive as well. It seems like they like to bring positivity to your, your sense of alternative style and the fact that you're a badass lady, woman, whatever you choose to identify as. I'll let you guys see it first because I'm just so nervous. Okay, you can't see it, you can't see it. Why does it smell like licorice? <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> that was the main reason I actually wanted, I, I'm excited to, to try this, that, 
I'm so excited that I can't actually talk. This was actually the main thing I've been excited about receiving because I am the type of person who will wear the same shoe every single day and that's no exaggeration. If you've ever met me before, if you've met me a couple of times, you'll probably know exactly what shoe I'm gonna have on my foot. I buy platforms, usually in sale, and I have to love them so much. Recently, it's been, oh, I just spat everywhere. <laughs> Recently, it's been one of these like really shiny platform shoes, similar to these, but these are suede. I'm hoping if these fit right and I love them and they're not too fat. I thought the platform was gonna be way too much. It isn't, it's perfect. If these are comfortable, this is gonna be perfect. It's gonna be my everyday wear. I hope they fit because I've decided to, I picked all of the shoes in a six. Crikey, if they all, if one, this one doesn't fit, they're all not gonna fit. So, you know, hello charity shops, <laughs> you're welcome. How lush is this? It's gorgeous. It's suede up here loads of platform i love also the reason why i always wear platform is because i don't mind my height i like the fact i'm small however i like that platform gives you a better posture i like how my posture changes in heel in like platforms when i'm wearing something that isn't platform i feel so slumpy and i actually feel really uncomfortable outside without being on some sort of stage because i'm just such a leo just kidding on my cancer so i don't go outside <laughs> i just laughed at my own joke <laughs> give me the right size okay they're both six like when you find such a perfect shoe i can just imagine something going wrong with them like i don't know they give me the wrong size or they set on fire but so far so good how fucking cute are they i love them i'm 100 percent happy i'm worrying whether this is going to crack at the bottom because it's not like spongy rubber it's not spongy maybe it's i feel like this rubber has a bit of plastic within it like materials kind of meshed inside i don't know how it works but um i've noticed with like plasticky rubber boots uh over time when you like obviously bend them enough from walking they start cracking and that affects like obviously keeping the shoe i don't know if that's going to be an issue yet it's hard to kind of tell when i haven't worn them around yet but maybe in vlogs and stuff you if you watch me religiously you'll soon know oh i might actually keep this box in fact i will keep these boxes because i need boxes weirdly actually i figured the other day to store my halloween decorations in i put my halloween decorations down and i was like where the hell am i gonna store all this stuff in nice little boxes and now i have nice little boxes oh i see them <laughs> i don't know why i'm not looking at them oh Whoa, 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 whoa. These are so nice. Once again, I don't know how the wear is gonna be on the actual shoe, the cracking situation. I hope you guys are gonna understand what I mean by that because that is a thing. Is there a way it tells you like what the material of the shoe is? Probably not because no one's as crazy as I am, but I'm very intrigued at the long termness of these shoes but this is not as high as i thought it was going to be which is a good thing can i just say like on the website they look very patronizing but also very badass but i think this is fine oh this the back has like this little ridge here am i gonna fall back on that no but at least shut up but i mainly picked these because of the white and the baby pink strap like how cute would that look like because it's kind of it's sort of like badass mixed with like hee -hee, i'm still cute and that's tr that's what i try to aim for in life <laughs> oh that girl looks really cool but she also looks like she won't rip my head off like i like that kind of aesthetic and it goes up the ankle a bit too i love this this would even go with what i'm wearing now oh my god i'm so excited you guys have no idea <sighs> They're so cute. <laughs> this is such a, do you know what's funny as well? I I chucked my, my a, few, a load of my shoes out. I don't know if this is what you call law of attraction, but I chucked my shoes out. Do you know what? I don't usually do that because I worry that I'm gonna have nothing left to wear on my feet, obviously. And then I'm gonna later regret the fact that I've got nothing to wear because I recently threw them out. But I needed to throw some of my stuff out, guys. I needed to, they were getting ridiculous. And then Lamoda was like, hey, you wanna work together? Do you want some shoes? And I was like, Universe, is that you? And the stitching as well. Can we talk about the stitching? Look at the stitching around those. Oh. <laughs> they will obviously be more of a going out shoe. These are more of a casual shoe. So look at the height difference. This is perfect. That's the casual. This is the going out. I used to, well, I still do sometimes wear my casual shoes as going out shoes. And although that's fine because my casual shoe looks like this, it feels to me like I'm not wearing going out shoes. I like to feel as though I feel in my in my good clothes, like my, my going out out clothes. You know what I'm saying? 
So that will feel like that. boxes left the boxes are a little dusty cute <laughs> okay these are like the casual badass bitch shoes oh <laughs> these are so cute in person these are cute in person right on the website i was getting really really overwhelmed by the options like i loved the shoe but i was like can i imagine me in those shoes can i imagine me wearing these huge crazy shoes they're not as crazy in real life and that sound may sound like a negative to some of you but to me it's refreshing because like they still look badass but like they they I don't, I don't know what i'm trying to say here look at that look at that zip detail studded oh, does it actually zip or is it like a fake zip it actually zips which is cool oh my god and i chose this mainly for the buckles and it's an actual like boot boot rather than like a chelsea boot so this is like fun fresh fruity this is like i'm going to kill your family if i don't fit these ones i think i'm going to be most annoyed about these ones if i'm honest i literally can't wait to the trying on part of this video that i'm just gonna try them on now they fit like a freaking glove <laughs> Mum, have I made it yet? I'm cool, look. Oh, and that can only mean the rest are gonna fit like a glove. would kiss you but I've got lip gloss on oh is this a sign it's broken <laughs> all the shiny ones these are wow this was another kind of safe shoe for me I want I definitely wanted to pick ones I could wear like a lot rather than I mean I could wear all of these a lot to be honest the only ones I wouldn't wear a lot are these ones because they are a lot more kind of going out these are really shiny really these are the most similar to the ones I've been wearing uh recently all the time this sort of shine but as a boot so it's like this style in this boot but this is a really cute playful kind of more casual if I need to go somewhere that's like not extra I'm excited to break into these like I'm really excited to break into these I feel like these will look nicer once they're broken into I, I don't really like the look of like fresh shoes and that may sound horrible to people but like like less stiff like I can't wait to break into these I can imagine these looking really cute with like kind of gothic black all over outfit with maybe like dusty pink tones in like the jewelry or hair accessories or something with black fishnets or something i don't know i'm imagining outfits more with this i don't know i don't know why <laughs> you so those are all of my shoes i really hope that you liked this video i hope that you're as happy with the items as i am I'm really really impressed like i said they look better in person which is quite rare usually they look better online and then you receive something and you're like mm. but they fit comfortably the material is really nice i can i feel like i can walk in every single one of them they, none of them make me feel uncomfortable or anything like i don't rock in any of the shoes which sometimes is a problem when the base is too thin um, and I, I just feel comfortable in them all. I feel comfortable, I feel confident in them all. That is all, thank you very much for watching this video. I will see you very soon for more fashion, alternative fashion sort of videos. Loads of love from my house to yours. I'm on social media such as Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. I do tarot readings, if you wanna book one, email me down there. And I also have a Patreon and I stream live 
every week. So I will see you very soon. Goodbye.